the group by function in Excel can be used to quickly summarize data in tabular form. Take a look at this table. Here we have the three months customer data of a travel agency. Name of the month in the first column. Name of the customer in the second column. Name of the activity in the third column. Number of persons in the fourth column. Customer's country in the fifth column. And the amounts collected from the customers in the last column. We have more than 200 records here. Now let's see how we can summarize this data using the new group by function in Excel. Suppose I want to know the total amount collected for each activity. To create a report like that, equal, type in group by. See the new group by function is listed here. First argument or the first input of group by function is row fields. Activities are listed in the column called activity. Let's select this column for row fields. Control shift down arrow, control backspace, comma. Second argument or the second input of group by function is values. Amounts are in the column called amount. Select the column called amount. Control shift down arrow, control backspace, comma. Third argument or the third input of group by formula is function. Different aggregations like sum, percent of, average are listed here. In this case, we need the sum of amounts. Select sum, comma. Fourth argument of group by formula is field headers. To display the corresponding headers in the results, select the fourth option, 3, yes and show. Close parenthesis, enter. We have the total amount received for each activity and the grand total in the last row. Now if you want the amount collected in each month, that is June, July, August. Copy this formula. We'll paste it here. Let's modify the references. Row fields will be the column containing months. Enter. We have the total amount collected in each month and the grand total in the last row. Needless to say, group by function is dynamic and any change we make in the source data will be reflected simultaneously in the result. Let me change the value in this cell. We'll replace 7000 with 1 lakh and the results updated accordingly.